Brenda Sylvia. I'm excited to have my show Zestful Nature here at the Midway Gallery at the Cultural Arts Center at Glen Allen. Um, as you might see from my work, I love color and I love nature and this is uh, some of my favorite paintings that I've done recently. This is my painting Social Isolation. Um, I was inspired to do this painting at the beginning of the COVID epidemic because everything sort of came screeching to a halt and I was looking for inspiration. So I found this beautiful tree in the middle of the field and of course I brought my own colors into the painting. I used to live in the Caribbean and I brought the beautiful bright light and color into my work in Virginia. So one of my goals in my paintings is to kind of capture the feeling that I have in a particular place. And in these four paintings there are very distinct areas um, some of you in Richmond might recognize this trail along the banks of the James River. Um, this is actually up in Ketchikan, Alaska. Um, I got lucky enough to go up and spend a week up there, and it's a very different feeling, hopefully, that you'll get from the two. This painting is from a trip I did in Montana, and this one is where I spend a lot of time kayaking where I live in Reedville by the Chesapeake Bay. my show Zestful Nature is because I have a lot of enthusiasm, as I said, about nature and color. Um, I wanted to particularly show you this painting called Over the Hill because I did paint this painting almost entirely on location. So I went out and set up my easel. I went back three, four different times. Um, I know one of the days I was painting, it was so windy, I was literally holding on to my easel as I was trying to paint. Um, but I think I did capture the spirit. These yellow flowers, these are canola flowers or rapeseed, and I'm lucky that they bloom in a lot of different fields in my area in April. So I always set aside some time to be outside painting. So when I'm not in my studio painting, I try to be outside on the water or hiking. Um, obviously, I didn't paint this from my kayak, but that is my kayak. I take a lot of reference photos when I'm out. And these two paintings were both done in the Tappahannock area and they were done, they're called studies, they were done on location in one city. So I love trees, they show up in a lot of my paintings. Uh, this painting in particular, I tried a different technique. I was actually at a thrift store and I found a bag of little paper leaf cutouts, punch outs that someone had done and I actually collaged them into the painting. Another neat thing about this painting was that it was juried into a special show at uh, Lewis Ginter Botanical Gardens. Okay, so I also love the mountains, and this painting on the top here is called Mountain Valley Paradise. And every year, um, I get to go up and paint at one of my friend's places in Withville, Virginia. And um, I just love the feeling, and I was trying to capture the sense of the moving water and the beautiful light playing through the valley. This painting is called The Sentinels, and it really shows my love of color, I think, a lot. Um, and it is part of my Trails and Trees series. I did a, a lot of paintings just all about moving through life and choosing your path. Um, this one on this side is one of my favorite places down where I live to kayak to. It's called Teepee Island, and this is the shore of the Chesapeake Bay.